But now where Beatty is, one strikeout shy of matching his career best of 11. A feat he accomplished last year in May. There's a curveball to open up the at-bat to Ryan McMahon, and it graces the outside corner for strike one. A couple of the strikeouts for McMahon so far tonight. He's 0 for 3. Four runs on eight hits for the Squirrels, no runs on two hits. And two errors for Hartford. Infield looking to turn two behind Beatty to end the game. Here comes the right-hander, and a line drive foul off to the left, and that's strike two on McMahon. Still throwing 94 in the ninth inning. And that's the beauty of Beatty. He knows how to preserve his arm so that he can live 91 to 93. And now he's saving it all for this ninth inning right here. Trying to put away Ryan McMahon, and the right-hander throws the curveball to the dirt, stopped by Steve LaRue behind the plate, who's called a phenomenal game for the Flying Squirrels tonight. Thought maybe Craig Westcott or... Mike Kicka might have been that first nine-inning contest, but not finding that here. Two strikes on the hitter, McMahon. Swing and a miss. 95 by Tyler Beatty. And he matches his career best. 11 Ks for the Giants' top pitching prospect. 